Greeting, greeting, this is Mark Brown. We're going to be looking at how we can uninstall this particular app. Now we have it here in the taskbar, but not really using it. I have no use for it. Just want to get rid of it. How are we going to get rid of it? First thing we want to come right to the startup menu. We're going to click. we going to bring up this local window here. So this is settings. We're going to click on settings because we're going to uninstall it. And here you go. And then you're going to come right here that set apps. We're going to click on it, then open up the next window. So right below here, you will see a list of apps. If you want to come over here, put the cursor right here and take a little bit of time and come down with it so that you can actually see exactly the app that you're looking for. I take a little bit of time and scroll up. I take a time and scroll up. That is the run for it. And there you go. This is the app. So what you want it to do, you're going to click on it. You know, you click on it, you notice here to modify what it's not highlight. It's uninstall, you click on uninstall. Now we show you right up here, you said this app and it related into will be uninstall. I'm going to click on install yes, again. You notice right here, you show sure that it's actually uninstall. Alright, and it's very important here. If you notice, are you sure you want to completely move limbs? Then I'm going to say yes. Alright, and if you notice right here, I should say it's actually uninstall here. Right, very important here. And that's how it actually look like. And if and when you want to uninstall, that's the route you're going to take on it. Right. So you see right here, so to please wait for things to remove from your computer. Right. And if you notice right here, if you're uninstalling, it is time processing. Right. So this is how you go about uninstall up. I think you notice this looks tricky, take your time moving slowly or surely. Take your time come up. And when I say exactly how it looks like when it actually come to the end, what it actually show. Right? And in the meantime, if you notice the knowledge pressure hub will actually present by the exam. This is says it's a flashback, but you can actually use the record. Your box you can actually use the score story and all of that. Here you get message right here. Google Chrome. Here you can actually look at music and all that is free. Are the street now that's very important. Now, what you say notice is the app and feature default app, offline map, app for website, and video playback, and startup. So, that's exactly what you see in this particular area here, right? And if you learn something from this, just remember to share with your friends.